What's going on everyone? Today we're gonna to show you a quick at-home ab workout. This is gonna be level one. We're gonna do harder ones as we progress forward. This is a great place to start. You know, don't be worried or feel bad. You can't completely finish it. Another quick tip is if you put the tongue, your tongue to the roof of your mouth, on a lot of these crunches, it's gonna help alleviate some of that neck soreness. It's a weird tip, but it works amazingly. Let's jump right into it. Here we go. So, first off, we're just gonna start by firing up the lower abs here with some flutter kicks. So we're gonna go in here. We're just gonna go until our timer runs out. Kicking. Now with these, point your toes. Keep your legs as straight as you can. Keep kicking. And keep going here. Stay strong. You know, you don't wanna be going too fast, not too slow, you want control. Right from that lower ab, feel it. I like to put my hands under my butt. Some people like to have them by their sides. Nothing wrong with either. Now we're gonna switch to scissors. Here we go. Getting those lower abs working. We're gonna go lower to mid to oblique. That's how we're gonna run the circuit. Nice and wide, cross them over. Keep going, keep going. Gotta get done to that timer. We're cooking it here. Let's go people, Keep crushing it. Should be feeling the burn now. Getting these suckers fired up. Keep going, let's go, we're almost there. Five, four, three, two, and boom. Good, so because this is short, we're gonna just keep crushing it. There's gonna be very little rest. Next up, we have a cross arm crunch. So you're gonna bring your feet to this right angle, cross your arms, and here we go. One, one to 30 reps, two. Make sure you breathe, breathe from that diaphragm. So you're gonna engage those abs the best you can. Here we go. Keep it going. Halfway, let's get it. Try and crunch those abs. I got powerlifting abs right now. Thicker, not as lean as I've been. That's okay. Still gotta hit them. Let's get it. Ten. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Beautiful. All right, up we go into the obliques. So you got this right angle here. You're gonna cross your arms, cross your legs, touch the ground. Let's go. Here we go. Three, three, four, four, five, five. Keep it going. Eight, eight. You don't want to give up. You're not going to give up. Let's go. Fourteen, fifty, fifty. Let's go. Eighteen, eighteen. Boom. Here you go. Nice and brutal. Next up, we're going to some scissors. Get those lower abs fired up again. Hands under your butt. Leg straight, one leg up, one leg down. Switch it out. And switch. And switch. Keep it going. I know the abs are burning. This is level one. Gotta make it through this and get to our harder ones coming up. Let's go. Halfway, 10 more. Eight, let's go. Seven. Wait till you the number to switch. Six, be a little mean here. Five. Four, three, let's go. Two, last one. Boom. Beautiful. All right, second last exercise. Hopefully you're hanging in. I'm feeling it. Getting my sweat going. Hands behind your head. Feet up. We're gonna crunch up. One, two. Try to get as close as you can to that knee. Three. It's okay that someone gets in the way a little bit. Seven, let's go. Eight, nine. 10, 12, let's go, 14, 15, let's go, three more, three, two, last one, Woo. Ab should be feeling it by now, we got one more to go, it's going to be a little bit of a bleak, a little bit of rectus abdominis, a little bit of everything, so these are just going to be your good old V sit up, legs nice and wide, hands behind your head like this, and sit up, touch one toe, come down. Hands, you can use your hands here for a little bit of an A. If you're crazy, you can try to do it with no hands. It's a whole different beast. Let's get this is your last one. I'm not feeling crazy, and that's okay. You can go at your pace. Let's go. Let's get it. Come on, we're almost there. Just a little burn. Let's go, 11, 12, come on. 13, if I can do this, my powerlifting physique being 220 right now, you can do this easy, let's go. 16, 17, come on, three more. 
18, keep those legs wide as you can. Twist those obliques to the top. 19, last one. Boom, there we go. So that's level one. I should be feeling it. I know I'm feeling it. Remember, always to breathe, engage those suckers. Smash like if you enjoyed this. Definitely feeling it. You know, no matter if you're bulking, cutting, whatever. Right now I'm at the end of my bulk, so I'm not as lean as I've been in this photo here. But I still like to train my abs. Keep that core, keep it in control. But once again, comment down below if you wanna see level two, level three, it's gonna be a whole nother world. And click that first link in the description down below. We've got a free gift for you, some free home workouts. We wanna give you our personal trainer in our pocket, how to do a ton of exercises, and our supplement 101 ebook, all for free. So just go ahead, click that link, enjoy that. Keep hitting this workout. If you're wondering how many days a week to do it, I recommend twice a week. And if you're a little crazy, you're three days a week. But just remember, you don't need to do your abs every day. You don't train your muscles every day. Let them heal two to three times a week. Peace out.